In emergencies or remote areas, staying connected can make the difference between life and death. Today, we're breaking down 11 crucial off-grid communication methods to help you stay connected when traditional networks fail. First up, ham radios. These are a top choice for long-distance communication, operating on shortwave frequencies and connecting users over hundreds of miles. Whether in a natural disaster or power outage, ham radios provide a reliable way to stay in touch with the outside world. A license is needed to operate them, but they're indispensable in off-grid situations. Next, CB radios. These are short-range devices commonly used by truckers, but equally valuable for off-grid living. With a range of about 10 to 20 miles, CB radios allow groups in close proximity to communicate easily without needing cell towers. For larger groups or those in wilderness areas, CB radios can be a lifeline. Now let's talk about satellite phones. When cellular networks are down, satellite phones come to the rescue. These devices connect directly to satellites orbiting the Earth, allowing you to make calls or send texts anywhere on the planet. While a bit pricey, satellite phones are a must-have for adventurers and preppers who need global coverage. For those looking for a simpler option, two-way radios or walkie-talkies are perfect. They're small, easy to carry, and reliable within short ranges, making them ideal for local communication during camping, hiking, or even in urban emergencies. Mesh networks are another innovative solution, especially when you have multiple devices. These systems enable peer-to-peer -peer communication without a central server, allowing users within a network to communicate even if traditional infrastructure is down. Other alternatives include low-tech methods like signal mirrors and whistles. Signal mirrors can reflect sunlight over long distances, providing a visual cue for rescuers or other off-grid contacts. Whistles are simple but effective, with sound carrying far enough to draw attention in a crisis. Apps like FireChat use Bluetooth to create local, internet-free communication networks. This can be helpful in crowded areas or during protests where cellular service might be disrupted. Lastly, it's important to have solar chargers. Off-grid communication tools are useless if you can't power them. Solar panels and chargers help ensure your devices stay operational, even when there's no access to electricity. In summary, having a reliable off-grid communication plan is essential for survival. Whether you're prepping for a disaster, embarking on a remote adventure, or simply living off the grid, these 11 methods can help keep you connected when it matters most.